Hello friends, welcome to our channel Rising Star. In the previous videos, we saw that how to solve the examples of multiplication in which was below the base, above the base. But in this video, we are going to see how to solve the examples of multiplication in which one is above the base and one is below the base. So let's begin. Let's begin with our example. We have followed to follow the same steps, but something is different. So first of all, draw a line. Then write here sum. Then write here product. And now then find the base. See, we have to follow find the base. Next is deviation. Then is sum. And last is product. So, let's find the base. 113 and 97 are equal to 100. So, no, equal to not are near to 100. So, let's write the base as 100. Now, let's find the deviation. You have to subtract the base from the numbers. 100, 113 minus 100. Here will be 13. And 197 minus 100. Answer will be minus 3. So, right here 13. And here minus 3. Now, let's find the sum. You can add these or this. Answer will be same. See, 113 plus minus 3. Answer will be 110. And here, 97 plus 13. Answer will be 100. And, sorry. Answer will be 110. Ten. So just write 110 here. Now let us find the product. We have to multiply this. 13 into minus 3. Answer will be minus 39. So write minus 39 here. But this can't be a number. So you have to just add one, you just add one step. Just subtract one from this number. Which is at left place. Here will come 109. And just add. See. And just add base to this number. So here add 100. And just add them. See. Here will be 1. And 9 and 3. 6. So. This will be our answer. See. I will just write it. Answer will be. 113 into 97 will be. 10,961. You can check it in calculator. Let's begin with the next example. Let's begin with our next example. We have taken 1009 into 998. So, just write it. 1009 into 998. First of all, draw here a line. Now, write here some. Now, write here product. Next step is to find the base. See, 1009 and 998 are near to 1000. So, 1000 will become our base. See, 1000 is our base. Now, next step is to find the deviation. For finding the deviation, you have to subtract the base from the numbers. Here, 1009 and 998 are the numbers. So, you have to just subtract the base from these numbers. See, 1009 minus 1000. Our first deviation will be 9. And next, see, 998 minus 1000. Our second deviation will be 
minus 2. So you have to just write the 9 and minus 2 here. See, 9 and here, minus 2. Now next step is to find the base. No, sorry, for fi uh, to find the sum. For finding the sum, you can add this or this. Answer will be same. Let's check. See, 1009 plus minus 2. See, 1009 plus minus 2. Answer will be 1000 and, sorry, answer will be 1007. Or, see, 998 plus 9. 998 plus 9. Answer will be 1007. Both are the same. So, you have to just write that 1007 here in the sum section. This is our sum section. You have to write it here. Next step is to find the product. For finding the product, you have to multiply this. See, 9 into minus 2. 9 into minus 2. Answer will be minus 18. Minus 18. So, you have to just write that minus 18 in the product section. But, this can't be a number. So, you have to just follow one more step. See? I will erase it so you can understand. You have to just subtract 1 from the sum side. See? 1007 minus 1. Answer will be 1006. See? 1006. And you have to add the base to this number. See? 18 minus 18 plus our base is 1000. So you have to just add this 1000 here. See? Here. This. And see. So, 1009 into 998. Our answer will be... Ten lakh six thousand nine hundred and eighty-two. Let's begin with the next. Let's begin with the next example. See, we have taken one hundred and two into eighty-nine. So, first of all, draw here one line. Here will come sum. Here will come product. Now let us find the base. One hundred and two and eighty-nine are near to. 100. So, 100 will become to 100 will become the base. Now, let us find the deviation. You have to subtract the base from these numbers. 102 minus 100. Answer will be 2. And here, 89 minus 100. Answer will be minus 11. So, just write your deviations. Here, 2 and here, minus 11. Now, let us find the sum. You can add this or this answer will be same. See, 102 plus minus 11. Answer will be 91. Okay. Answer will be 91 or 89 plus, sorry, 89 plus 2. Answer will be 91. So just write 91 here and this. Now let's write the product. You have to multiply this. 2 into minus 11. Answer will be minus 22. So just write minus 22 here. But this can't be a number. So just subtract 1 from the sum side or left side. Minus 1. Here will become 90. And now just add base to this number. See, here 100. Here 8. Here 7. Therefore, see, this will become our answer. 102 into 89 is equal to 9078. I have prepared some examples for you. Try to solve this example using this method. And answer me in comment section. If you like the video, please like, share and subscribe it. Thank you.